Hey everyone, it's Gus, and today we're gonna see top 10 tips on how to go vegan. On my last video, some of you asked me how to go vegan, if I can give you some tips. So, this is it for today. Before we start, make sure you subscribe to my channel for new videos every Thursday and Sunday. So now, let's get started. First of all, take it slow. I was vegetarian for eight months before I became vegan. I know some vegans that were never vegetarians, and that worked for them. But if you find it difficult, take it step by step. There is no need for you to shock your body if you don't feel ready for it. Reach out to other vegans for help or advice. If you don't know anyone, join groups on Facebook, forums on Reddit, or meet up with people on Meetup. With this way, you can make new friends as well. I assure you, only the first month is difficult. After that, you're gonna love your body, you're gonna love the energy, and you're gonna love your new diet. But bear with yourself for this first month. Going from meat eating or being vegetarian to a whole new level of vegan diet is indeed difficult because you need to change something you're doing every single day in your life from when you were born until now. So yes, it's difficult because you used to do something and you're changing it, but after the first month, your body will adapt to the new data and the new diet and you're gonna love the results. Trust me, explore the new world. In other words, Try new things. There are so many choices of food that I didn't know existed before I went vegan. And now I can't believe I never tried these recipes or food or whatever before in my life. They're delicious! So don't try to substitute every single meal you had before you went vegan with vegan substitutes. You can do it for some time until your body gets used to it, but don't try to imitate every single food you ate before with vegan substitutes, because that's unhealthy. And also, there are so many choices to explore out there. Why not do that? Try milk alternatives. There are so many delicious alternatives out there, and you can find one that suits you, and only you. Some choices are almond milk, soy milk, coconut milk, hemp milk, pea milk, and rice milk. Read books and manuals to make sure you get your nutrition right. One book that I can suggest is Vegan for Life by Jack Norris and Virginia Messina. You can find it on Amazon. Check out for vegan places in your town or in nearby towns. Not only you're gonna find delicious new food, but you're gonna get some ideas about recipes you can cook alone at home. For whatever recipe you want, go to Pinterest. It's awesome! You can find every single recipe you want in vegan and you can make it at your own convenience whenever you want and you can find very simple recipes. It's awesome! Have many meals a day to keep your energy levels up. Or if not meals, be sure that you have your snacks ready. By meals, I mean three main meals and three snacks at least. With this way, you keep your energy levels on and you are never hungry. Always remember why you started, whether the reason was to improve your health or to support animal rights. If you feel demotivated, go rewatch some documentaries you watched before to inspire you and give you motivation to go on. So that's all for today. If you're vegan, leave some tips down below on how to go vegan for our viewers. If you're not a vegan and you want to go vegan, I hope this helps. In any case, leave your comments down below. If you like this video, click the like button, subscribe for more new videos every Thursday and Sunday. But for now, bye-bye!